DaVinci Resolve for noobs. The Bat Hunter gave me a $5 super thanks. Thank you very much for that, my friend. And asked me, when you're editing a video and you're ready to render, what's the best settings to have it set? Because when I upload it to YouTube, my videos become pixelated and I want to increase my quality. When you first open a project, what you want to do is go down to the lower right, click on that gear icon, and this will open up your project settings. This is where you can set your timeline resolution and the frame rate for your project. Before you set this, make sure this matches the footage that you filmed. If you don't know the resolution and frame rate that you filmed, make sure you find it on your system, right click on that file, go down to properties, and in the properties window, open up details, and you'll see I filmed at 3840 by 2160, that's UHD 4K, and at 30 frames per second. So I want to set this for 3840 by 2160 Ultra HD. I want to make sure the frame rate is 30, not 24. That will change the playback and the format for video monitoring. This is currently set for 1080 for the video monitor. I don't mind it being set a little lower because I don't need it to be in full 4K while I'm editing on that smaller window. I can always change that later, but I'll click save. And now when I go to import that media into my media pool and I bring that down into my timeline, it's going to play back as crisp, as clear, and as smoothly as it did on my computer before I brought it into Resolve. Now when it comes time to export that footage, what I'm going to do is go to the Deliver page. I'm going to use Custom Export and I'm going to export to a location right on my computer because I do not want to use any of these other features that might export and upload directly to platform and potentially compress my footage to a lower resolution. Create the title, choose the location, and then under the export video tab, I choose the format. Typically MP4 for YouTube is what you'd want to use. And then the codec should be either H.264 or H.265. H.265 is going to add a little more complex compression and make the file size a little bit smaller, but either one can work for YouTube. And when it comes to the audio tab, I typically just keep it the same as the project and then I'm good to go to add that job to my render queue. And then I can just render that project. When you open up your video on YouTube from desktop, let's pick this one here, you'll see this little gear icon here you can click on and it shows you the quality or resolution that your video is being played back in currently. Now this one is set to auto and it told me it was playing back at 4K 2160. I saw that when I opened up this screen. If you're seeing pixelation, it could be YouTube just playing that video back at a lower resolution. When I open the same video up on mobile, if you look at the top, this video is only playing back at 720. What I need to do is hit the advanced option and that will allow me to pick a specific resolution and I can open it back up to 2160 and have it play back at the full 4K UHD resolution.